In order to edit format settings for a whole map in a standard way, you can just open your stylus management panel. In order to find this panel, you can go to menu bar, format, manage styles, and the last option is edit styles, and the assigned shortcut is also here, Ctrl F11. You can also find it opening the command search box and typing edit styles, and you will see a search found result, menu bar, format, manage styles, edit styles, and the assigned shortcut is also here, Ctrl F11. I always rather just hitting the shortcut. Here at this panel, you can change settings for the whole map. This panel is different from the other panel I was showing in the other video, the tool panel. You can check the video about tool panel in the card that is being displayed here above this video. Remember, we only use tool panel to change format settings for one or another node once in a while. We should never use this very often. And getting back to the stylus management panel, this panel is for changing settings for the whole map. For example, whenever I use this panel, I only change settings for my default node. For example, in this my presentation map that I use to create the tutorial videos for this channel, my default node minimum and max width is 90 on both fields. And if you check this other personal map that I have, my default node max and minimum width, it's 100. Because in this case, I try to make the nodes and the font size as small as it could be so I can fit as much information as I can on the screen. So if I make this value bigger, let's say 150 in both fields, hit Ctrl Enter. As you can see, the standard symmetric size of my map nodes became larger. And if we get back to the style of management panel, select the default node and set a smaller value here, let's say 40 on both fields and hit Ctrl Enter. As you can see, my map node standard symmetric size became much smaller. Let me set back to 90 and hit Ctrl Enter. So whenever I change any Anything here at the stylus management panel, I personally only change my minimal and max node width. You can play around with this and just click here or hit Ctrl Enter to save the settings and close the stylus management panel. I love the fact that Freeplane allows us to configure basically anything you want. Here at the stylus management panel, also here at the tools panel, also here at the preferences, and in many other options that we have at menu bar. And the Freeplane standard configuration and settings are so well set that we basically don't need to change much. So this video was just to show you the very basic about the style management panel and how I personally use it. In future videos, I'll be making a very complete breakdown about everything on the style management panel. But meanwhile, you can also feel free to play around with all the settings, save it and close styles management panel or just hit Ctrl Enter. This is it for now. See you in the next video.